first, start your engines! We are back for heat race number four in the Tyler Daniels Racing League of Legends Weekend Warrior Series from USA International Speedway. I'm Aaron Johnson with the Johnson I Racing Team, bringing you what should be an outstanding event from USA International Speedway. Let's have a look at the starting grid for heat race number four. Starting in the rear of the field in car number 17, that will be Robert Trask, and just to his outside, will be car 29 of Hootis Niskowiak. In the second row on the inside will be car number 48, that's Matty Moniak, and to his outside will be the 28 of Jim Downham. On the front row outside will be the 61 of Fish Fisher, and on the pole in car number seven, that will be Jed Cotterman. Cotterman, the founder of the Cotterman iRacing team. Fisher and Niskowiak, members of the Johnson iRacing team. Matty Moniak, the, uh, the uh, publisher of Maniac Gaming. So a lot of drivers here with some affiliations. Cotterman on the pole ran a great lap, a 23.570 qualifying lap, very quick at USA International Speedway. Lights are off on the pace car. This heat race, the fourth heat of the day, 27 drivers in all have entered, scheduled for 10 laps. Cotterman, Fisher, Moniac, Jim Downham, Trask, and Niskowiak, the six drivers scheduled in this race, as Matty Moniak is right on the back bumper of that seven car, Jed Cotterman. The initial start of the race, always on green with TDR. After that, restarts are at the discretion of the leader. We wait for the green flag. Pace car is in. Green flag is out. Cotterman hammers the throttle. Looks like Moniac gets a great restart as well as the 61 of Fisher gets shuffled up just a little bit high. Out of turn number one and then through two onto the back straightaway. Cotterman will take the lead as Jim Downham very nearly goes around. Downham all kinds out of shape. Looks like he managed to save that car. He will fall all the way back to the sixth spot as it's Cotterman, Fisher, sorry, Cotterman, Moniac, Fisher, Niskowiak. Those your top four. Followed then by Trask and Downham. Jed Cotterman leads the way as he leads the field down the back straightaway. We see Fisher looking to the inside of the 48 of Moniac. No dice. Moniac staying out front, holding onto that low line. That is the quick way around. Jed Cotterman pulling away. Looks like Moniac goes around. Don't know if Fisher got into him there or if Moniac went around on his own. Matty Moniak will drop to the rear of the field out front. It will be the seven of Cotterman, followed by Fisher and Niskowiak, with Trask running in the fourth spot. Remember, top three drivers move directly to the A main. Everyone else will race for position via the consolation race system. Out front, Cotterman leads, seven to go. Jed Cotterman on cruise control as he pulls away from the 61 of Fisher. In the third spot, that's the 29 of Niskowiak as Fisher beginning to pull away from Hootis. In the fourth spot, that's the 17th of Robert Trask. Downham in fifth, Moniak in sixth. Let's have a look at each car in the field in that second spot. That is car number 61 of Fish Fisher. Fisher, the owner of Admin Box. I'd like to thank Fish for providing Admin Box products to allow us to better administer these iRacing events for TDR. In the third spot, that's the 29 of Hootis Niskowiak. Niskowiak putting a little distance between himself and the 17 of Robert Trask. Trask currently running in the fourth spot. Well behind them, it looks like the 28 of Jim Downham is in the fifth position with Matty Moniak in car 411. In sixth, Moniak has withdrawn from this race. We'll go back to Jed Cotterman. Five cars remain on the speedway. Cotterman, Fisher, Niskowiak, Trask, and Downham. Moniak off the speedway at this point in time. Out front, it is the seven of Jed Cotterman. 
Cotterman holding on to the lead. He comes out of turn number two. Four laps remain in this 10-lap feature event. Jed Cotterman pulling away from the field. Looks like he's out for a Sunday drive in the familiar white, black, and red Cotterman Eye Racing Team Legends car. Out of turn four, now past the start finish line. Three to go. Cotterman hanging on to the lead. Fisher pulling away from Nascoiak. Nascoiak trying to hold off the 17 of Trask. Looks like he's put some distance between himself and Trask. These cars well lined out now. The finishing order all but certain unless someone makes a mistake. Jed Cotterman in the seven car. Two laps to go this time by. Cotterman hanging on to the lead as he pulls away from the 61 of Fisher. Cotterman out of turn two onto the back straightaway, running a brilliant race, nice and smooth, no mistakes. Jed Cotterman doing a great job of wheeling that seven car around this big high banked speedway. Out of turn four, Cotterman will take the white flag this time by. One to go, Jed Cotterman into turn number one for the final time in this event. He'll come out of turn two onto the back straightaway. Jed Cotterman running a fine race this afternoon. Cotterman down the back stretch will roll into turn number three. That seven car easing smoothly through the transition between three and four. Now out onto the front straightaway. It'll be Jed Cotterman taking the victory in heat race number four. Behind Cotterman, Fisherman will come home second with Trask in third as he makes his way past the 29 of Nascoiak. Nascoiak fourth, Downham fifth, and Moniak finishing sixth. That will do it. Cotterman, Fisher, and Trask secure their positions in the main. For the rest of the drivers, they'll have to fight for position in the consolation event that will be coming right up. We will be back to show you the consolation event in the TDR A League of Legends Weekend Warrior Series from USA International Speedway. <laughs>